What is up, motivators? Stats on four, Paul here. Time for a little bit of windshield wisdom. But uh, what I want to talk about today, it comes into stressing out over things where the results haven't even happened yet, right? How many times have you found yourself in a spot where you're so worried, so anxious, so nervous about the outcome? And usually it's what if this happens? What if that happens? What if I don't stick my landing? What if I don't stick my guy? What if I don't uh, pass this test? What if I answer all the questions wrong? What if I just absolutely make a fool of myself? Well, if you're constantly thinking about that, like that's exactly what's gonna happen. If you think about the negative outcomes, that's the only thing that's gonna happen. You know, how can you expect the outcomes you want without actually seeing it? For example, how many times have you thought about something actually going your way? And then all of a sudden you're surprised. It's, hey, it actually worked. It actually went through. I got the little parking space or, you know, so-and-so said hi to me. You know, maybe you got a crush on someone. Whatever the case is, and it, and it actually went through. You want to know why? It's because you believed and saw exactly what you wanted. That's why. But it takes mental discipline to do that all the time. And too many times, everyone's just wrapped up in their own little here and now, in the, and it's the negative aspect. For example, I, I, have, uh, I work with individuals all the time in terms of the ASVAB. They're so worried about what they're going to get on the ASVAB. And you know, I tell them, I'm like, hey, yes, the ASVAB is, is here and now, right? And you want to do good, and I get that. I'm right there with you. I want you to do good because that leads to, you know, more quali- uh, being qualified for, you know, the 350 jobs we have. I want that for you. I want you to have options. But if you concentrate on the negative outcome, like what if I don't do well, then it limits my options and that's exactly what's going to happen. So what I always tell people is, hey, you need to concentrate and truly think that you've already crushed it. You've already done your best. And that applies to anything, just doing your best. And what usually happens is that they crush it. They crush it every single time. So you need to start doing that for yourself in every aspect of your life, guys. You know, everything, whether it be going to talk up to that girl, going to talk to the guy, going to, you know, try new things. Don't ever be scared about it. Actually already see the outcome going your way. That's what you need to do. But it takes putting yourself in an environment where you constantly are thinking that way and you have the encouragement it comes from your surroundings so if you don't have a way or you don't have an environment in which you can do that i challenge you to go look for one challenge you to go look for one where hey all you envision is success and and failure is not an option you cannot fail that is what's going to help you need to look at that all right because too many times people are wasting away their dreams, wasting, wasting away their aspirations, all because they concentrate on the negative what ifs. Well, how about this? What if it actually worked out? With that, guys, hit me up if you ever need anything. You know, let people know about this video, let people know about my content. If you know you like it, it helped you out, drop a comment. If not, you just want to relish in it, that's cool too. All right, I'm not looking for millions of likes or anything like that. All I'm looking for is making a difference for you and letting you know what I know so that you can go out and crush and accomplish what you want. I know a way that can make it happen. All right, help you out just like it has uh, literally almost 100 other people uh, for me personally. So hit me up, Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, let people know. And by all means, even if it's just to stay motivated yourself, I'm good with that too. But let me know what you like, what you don't like. I want to make things better for you guys. And by all means, if you want me to talk about something, drop a comment. Let me know. If you got questions, I'll give you my perspective. I'll give it to you straight. So peace out for now. And uh, let's get it.